suppose you'd call it a working class town. Um, it, the, the economy here is based on um, the two main industries, which is coal and, and sugarcane, and that's where obviously the name Mackay Cutters come from. When I first came here, I, I um, you know, uh, I probably didn't think that I'd stay that long, but um, you know, the, the longer that I'm here, I'm, I'm you know, I'm enjoying it. Yeah, exciting news that was um, basically announced. Uh, last year, that uh, the federal government uh, are giving us $8.8 .8 million to, to build a new stadium. What it'll be is it'll be a, a stadium that'll hold about 10 to 12,000 people and it'll be the home of the Mackay Cutters. So, um, you know, it'd be great to see the Cutters running out in, in, in a nice new facility like that and, and great for the supporters and sponsors and all those sort of people to, to, to be able to come and watch football and, and you know, sit in a decent stadium. So I hope that in five to ten years' time is that the Mackay Cutters are the leaders of the Queensland Cup, not only just in on the field, but also in the facilities that we have off the field and the sponsors and you know and hopefully the culture that we're creating. Come back with um, to play with Mackay Cutters. Got the opportunity to come back here, they um, name a captain and that. Um, yeah, just wanted to come back to family and that, with my girlfriend. Well when I first moved back, I never had no employment, so I just rang the cutters up and they got me a job straight away. I was storming. A few of the boys Stormans, a um, few of the boys on uh, Queensland Rail, on the railway, a couple of boys are tra tradesmen. I'm hoping we get to the semis, or I reckon we will get to the semis. Um, we keep our form up and that. Like, defensively, we're pretty good as a team and a whole pack. Pretty good, yep. Yeah. We're a feeder team to the North Queensland Cowboys, and the players come down Friday for one session, and you know, sometimes we have anywhere from one or two players up to seven or eight, which we did last year. And you know, to, to get maybe a third up to a half sometimes of a team for one training session it is hard. And we've had a, a real focus on a, a real team environment this year and uh, do something for someone else, whether that's on the field or off. And you know, I think that it's showed in how we've sort of started the year as a team. When we're not on the training paddock or on the field together, a lot of our boys, if we go for a beer or we go for dinner, you know, they ring and say, oh, do you want to go out? And, and it's a, we invite a lot of the team as well. So that, that definitely helps and um, we've just got to keep building on it. You know, we've got a couple of rivalry games, I suppose you can say, in the next couple of weeks and, and that's good for footy. It, it, you know, always rivalry generates interest and, um, you know, hopefully we can come out of the, these games with a couple of wins and, and keep moving up that ladder. Mm -hmm.